Hi everybody, welcome back to Thoughtful Thursdays. Today's devotion is entitled, Prayer. And the verse for today is John 16, 33. I have told you these things so that in me you may have peace. In this world you will have trouble, but take heart, I have overcome the world. It had been a hot, dry summer. So when lightning struck and forest fires began burning, no one was surprised. In the high mountains, fires raged close to a Christian youth camp. Everyone had been safely evacuated, but the lodge and cabins were threatened. Word went out to the churches in the area and prayers surrounded the lodge for protection. When the danger had passed and the camp staff and U.S. Forest Service officials were able to get back to the camp and assess the damage, they found that everything, trees and buildings, had burned down except for the lodge. A tree at the corner of the lodge had been destroyed and just a few scorch marks were seen on the building, but to their amazement, the lodge stood undamaged. We are so grateful when God intervenes and gives the protection or healing that we have asked for. Yet we have all known situations where we prayed, perhaps even fasted or asked others to pray, and the result was not what we hoped for. No miracle occurred. Our hopes were crushed. In Romans 9, Paul writes, What then shall we say? Is God unjust? Not at all. For he says to Moses, I will have mercy on whom I have mercy, and I will have compassion on whom I have compassion. It does not therefore depend on human desire or effort, but on God's mercy. Verses 14 through 16. The truth is, we can't always know the why in life. What we can rely on is that God loves us, He hears our prayers, and He will walk us through every situation whether it brings heartbreak or miraculous protection. Dear Father, thank you that you hear my prayers. I don't always understand why bad things happen, but I trust your love, your wisdom, and your goodness. Please fill me with your peace. And I just want to mention there is a specific channel I watch with uh, Andy and Peggy and I would just like to ask you guys to send warm wishes uh, well wishes and thoughts and prayers to them and I will link their channel in the description box if you'd like to go over and tell them your well wishes or prayers and you know we can't give up prayer is our hope we have our hope in Christ and we need to keep moving forward whether we understand God's plan or not and you know this world is a fallen world so we will reap unfortunately the cursed ways you know and we reap what we sow what we put into our body will affect our body and I'm not saying that to condemn anybody I'm just saying there's natural consequences but God is able when I was in elementary school he healed me of migraine headaches praise God because they were bad but I just want to encourage you guys to continue on in prayer keep looking up enjoy your weekend take care everybody God bless